वेलकम गाइस वेलकम टू माय चैनल अध्ययन विद फ्लो ओके लेट्स स्टार्ट विद पॉलिनेशन विदाउट पॉलिनेशन यू व्हाट यू एक्सपेक्ट दैट रिप्रोडक्शन इज अकर और नॉट नो 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 पॉसिबिलिटी ओके गाइस व्हाट इज पॉलिनेशन ट्रांसफर ऑफ पोलन ग्रेन्स टू द स्टिग्मा सिंपल गाइस दिस इज द व्हाट फीमेल सेक्स ऑर्गन यस दे आर द मेल सेक्स ऑर्गन हियर दे व्हाट दिस सिंथेसाइज is synthesized what pollen grains and now these pollen grains they transfer to the female sex organ this is the stigma part yes guys pollen grains they transfer towards the stigma part of female organ it may be with the help of uh, air yeah water any kind of animal means bee guys bees okay now there is many kind of pollination let's discuss one by one autogamies auto means always self means this kind of pollination occur in same flower man assume this is the plant okay i know not beautiful okay they have flower this is the what female reproductive organ and here is male reproductive the same flower perform pollination their flower part contain male sex organ and female sex organ so male sex organ synthesize what pollen grain and same pollen grain transfer to the same flower this phenomena we call it as a autogamy and this is the most common okay this is not okay common means this is the part of female sex organ here is stigma part and this is the long style part this is the ovary part and here male sex organ is present we call it as a stamen and they what they synthesize they synthesize pollen grain and the pollen grain come and situated here now pollen grains present and they make pollen tube and fuse with egg cell which carry by ovary simple or not now let's move forward okay some plants such as viola oxalis chamelina produce two type of flower okay let me check not compulsory na at the same time male and female sex organ is mature no this is not compulsory okay guys in some plants male part mature first and female part mature later okay let's discuss okay chasmogamous what do you understand by chasmogamous chasmogamous type is what all time like uh, male and female part both are open and they can pollinate together but cleistogamous guys those kind of flower na do not open do not open they don't open okay in such flower the anther and stigma lies close to each other when the anther dehesses in flower buds pollen grain comes to contact with the stigma and effect pollination guys they don't flower so in a pack shape they can pollinate together clistogamous flower produce a short seed set even the absence of pollinators guys clistogamous type of flower arrangement na they don't do not uh, they don't need pollination they don't need air for pollination they don't need water for pollination they don't need animal for pollination because they don't open how anyone come and they pollinate their pollen grains okay now ganito gami what you understand by this word look at here assume guys they have what male reproductive organ and female or, uh, reproductive organ their pollen grains move towards the same plant but different flower uh, this word same flower oh sorry sorry same plant but different flower not same we can say cross pollination in the case of xenogamy guys their pollen grains transferred to another another plant of flower okay now different plant different flower okay now agents of pollination who support pollination it may be a biotic factor like wind air and it may be biotic factor like animals means if bees are come and sucking here nectar then uh, pollen grains are attached with their legs attached to their suckers and when bee fly and suck another flower then their pollen grain drop there and now pollination is successful okay look at here wow what a beautiful look at here look at here guys look so beautiful 
पॉल्यूशन बाई विंड इज मोर कॉमन अमोंग एबायोटिक फैक्टर या विंड इज ऑल ऑफ देयर ना सो ईजिली विद द हेल्प ऑफ एयर दे कैन पॉलिनेट विंड करंट इट मे बी वाटर इट मे बी वाटर गाइज इट मे बी एनी काइंड ऑफ एयर इट मे बी एनी काइंड ऑफ एनिमल्स नॉट बीज इन फैक्ट बैड्स आर ऑल्सो हेल्पफुल एनी एनिमल्स वो फीड फ्लावर्स दे आर ऑल्सो हेल्पफुल इन पॉलिनेशन ओके ना वेलसन एरिया एंड हाइडिला दे आर एक्वेटिक प्लांट्स नाउ दे आर वाटर हेल्पफुल इन पॉलिनेशन वेट लेट मीन टेल यू क्या वेयर इज वेयर इज न्यू थिंग या इन वेलिसन एरिया द फीमेल फ्लावर रीच द सर्फेस ऑफ वाटर now this is the water medium and their their flower part reaches the surface why the long stalk the male flower or pollen grains are released on the surface of water here they are carried passively by water current okay guys this is a normal phenomena how water will helpful in pollination okay grow up guys look at here look at here there are the pollen grains water current how when water flow na how they reach towards the stigma there is the process of uh, valesnia plant how water helpful in pollination here bees are helpful in pollination means animal butterfly helpful in pollination flies beetle wasps ants moths birds like sunbirds hummingbirds bats they also helpful in pollination many kind of insect when they come for nectar they can transfer their pollination one flower to another flower look at here insect pollination here this is the insect is it visible guys this is the insect when they sucking nectar na then pollen grains attach with their leg attach with their wings attach their with mouth okay so they helpful in pollination okay now next thing is what you can collect the pollen grains and you can store also and here is pollen bank is also present you can store pollen grains yes you can store this thing okay guys in this part they describe you fertilization this is the what this is the female sex organ this is the what style this is the uh, sorry stigma this is the long cylindrical structure is style this is the ovary part here is ovule here is egg and in the middle part egg is situated here now here pollen grain come they arise their pollen tube and they fuse with egg cell and they release their male gamete now male gamete and egg cell fuse and make fertilization if another male gamete are fused with these pollen nuclei then we can call it as a double fertilization look at here here male gamete is come fuse come and fuse with egg cell means male gamete plus egg cell fuse we call it as a fertilization this is the structure of pollen tube they carry two male gamete if another male gamete fuse with these pollen nuclei we call it as a double fertilization and whatever i explain here now already all thing is written here how they come how they arise how they germinate how they fuse okay okay we can also do this artificially yes we can do this we can do pollination release the xine uh, uh, from the pollen grain and you can fuse with them okay now next thing we will cover in like bagging emulsification uh, emulsification guys artificial hybridization we will discuss in our next video okay we will meet in next video so thank you guys thank you for watching my videos and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you thanks a lot